Hello wonderful people, it's your British buddy Fatrick Swayze here and I'm here with another package opening. So without further ado, I'm going to jump straight into the package opening. I'm going to start on my Warlock and then move to my Hunter and my Titan. So as always we're going to start with some Trials Bounties. Starting off XL Student, not very good. Probably quickly dismantle. And then we're going to move on to some of the Crucible ones. Vigil Steps and Whispering Sphere, again not very good, delete both of those. Okay, on to the Crucible ones. Uh, in the Clash type, I'm going to get the Crest of Alpha Lupe, so that's quite nice. Uh, another nice exotic shard to add to the collection. Nothing really special there. Okay, four. Ooh, let's see what we got here. Okay, I think we're going to start off with Scout Rifles. So, last extremity, let's see if there's any good rolls. Nope, that's going to be dismantled. And before we move on any further, the Crucible package is waiting over there for me. So, I'm going to quickly go there. Alright, so that's a zero day dilemma. Let's see if there's anything good about it. Unfortunately, it's not. Ooh, actually. Yeah, no, I might actually keep that Rodeo Braced Frame. Hidden hand. That's a pretty tidy looking roll. Uh, I'm not going to lie. I'm going to go and dismantle that bond, however. Don't really fancy that. Quickly go back up and just lob it in the vault. Okay, next up we have the heavy weapon bounty, which I'm not really interested in, so let's get that out of the way. Chaotic neutral. That's three legendary shards. Okay, on to the sniper rifle, see what we'll get, an event horizon, not my favourite sniper but we'll see what it is, hidden hand, nice, hidden hand, quick draw, arm of one, and it's got long view, so yeah maybe that's, maybe that's worth keeping, that's probably like as good as you'll get in terms of that, maybe short gaze would be nicer but ah well. Alright, on to the final three bounties, hand cannon, sidearm and fusion, the ones I'm most interested in. Let's start off with a sidearm, I could really do with an iron wreath here. Ah, another Havoc Pigeon. That's frustrating. Check the yep, that's a straight dismantle. Let's see, anything else? Fusion Rifle, Hand Cannon. Go with the Fusion first. Ooh, a Panther Ray. Ah, oh, please, please be really well rolled. Icarus. Rifled Barrel and Underdog. Ooh, yeah, I'm definitely going to hang on to that 100%. Okay, let's move on to the last one, which is going to be the hand cannon bounty. It's a Finalis Peril. Luck in the chamber, rangefinder and rifle, please. That would be absolutely amazing. Ooh, that's not very good. Nope, not even a range perk to be seen in sight. So, yeah, other than that, uh, the Panther Ray actually looked pretty nice. Lovely, had to have Icarus, rifled barrel and underdog on it. So, yeah. Uh, let's move on to the Titan. Alright, so onto the Titan. Let's see what bounties we have. We've got the Supremacy one, Pulse Rifles, Shotguns, Snipers, Heavy Weapons, Hand Cannons, Fusions, and Sidearms. So let's start off again with the Supremacy one. Let's see what we get. We get an Encrypted Engram and a Strange Coin. That must mean uh, I must have something in the Postmaster slot. So let's have a quick look at that. Ooh, Apothesis Veil. Okay. I think I'll quickly just dismantle that. Uh, Postmaster's got a little bit full there. But yeah, I'll just continue. So, pulse rifles, shotguns. I think we'll start off with heavy weapons again. Ash Factory. Probably just going to be a straight dismantle. Yep. Okay, so on to the next one. We have the pulse rifle one. Let's see, Blind Perdition. <laughs> I've already got the Adept version, not really much point in having that, so that's going to be a dismantle. Uh, after that, we'll go with the Shotgun Bounty. Next big thing. Don't remember this being any good. Yeah, not very good. That's going to get straight dismantled as well. Let's see, on to the Sniper Bounty. Ooh, Way Lawrence March now. Uh, let's see if this has got a nice roll. I'd really like it to have Hidden Hand and Quick Draw. Ooh. 
Rifled, Sightsis, Viewtac, Texas, Underdog. No, not really feeling that roll. That's going to get dismantled. On to the side arm bounty. Please be an iron wreath. <sighs> and it's another Havoc Pigeon. I feel like this is just becoming a reoccurring theme with that side arm bounty. Just Havoc Pigeon every single time. Okay, let's go with a hand cannon first this time. A Byronic Hero. By, yeah, Byronic Hero. Reactive Reload. Ra, Reinforced. Ooh, no, not really. Not really feeling that. I think that'll get dismantled as well. More Legendary Marks. And the final one for my Titan, the Fusion Rifle Bounty. The Split Shift the Pro. Let's see what, ra what role that has. So, Battle Runner, Hand Laid Stock, Hot Swap. Not good at all. Nothing good from this Titan, unfortunately. So uh, I'm going to switch on to my Hunter. Okay, so I'm on to my Hunter. Let's start off this by opening up the Rift Bounty. So from that, I get the Astrocyte Verse. Never been that great an exotic. They buffed it and it was a little bit of fun to use, but unfortunately that's just going to be a straight dismantle. Next, we'll move on to the Heavy Weapon one again. Not expecting much. Steel Oracle. Not very good. And I'll go ahead and dismantle that. Uh, next up, I think I will go with the Sniper. Oh no, Pulse Rifle Bounty. So a BT9 Party Favor. Let's see if it's any good. No, not looking good so far. Braced Frame. Secret Round. Third Eye. I guess it's okay, but I'd usually run Memory of Gellion. So Third Eye for me is a bit of a uh, Wasted Perk. So, I'll get rid of that. Now, on to my favourite ones. Please, can I have an Iron Wreath and not a fourth Havoc Pigeon? Come on now, Bungie. And it's an Anton's Rule. So, I'll just quickly dismantle that. Go to the Crucible Quartermaster, because he's got something for me. So, what have you got for us, Shax? A 44 Curtain Call. Cool. Let's have a look what it's got. Seek Final Round. Hammer Forge, Replenish, no, this isn't going to be good enough for me. Right, last two bounties, Hand Cannon and Fusion, so I'm going to go with the Fusion Bounty. And Ashgraven's Flight, I already have quite a nice roll with this, but I'll just check it out. Surrounded, Knee Pads, and no range perks, so unfortunately that's definitely going to get dismantled. And the final one, the Hang Cannon Bounty. If it could please be a Finalis Peril or Ice Luna, that'd be absolutely amazing. Open it up. The Ill Will. And that's going to be the end of it. Unfortunately, we weren't able to get much good. I think the best thing we got out of all of the packages was the Panther Ray. And I think I'm going to be using that uh, a little bit. And a couple of nice range based perks on there. Thank you very much for watching, pity I wasn't able to get anything absolutely amazing, but I'll take the Panther Ray. If you could please like, comment and subscribe, that would be absolutely wonderful. This has been your British buddy, Patrick Swayze, and I'll catch you later.